Hello, my amazing, beautiful, wonderful, fantastic friends. Happy 2024. Today is January 1st, the very first day of the new year. And I just got to the gym. It's actually not that crowded. I came a little bit later than I usually do. It's a little bit past nine. In my head, I was thinking like, oh, if I go during this time, maybe a lot of people will be working already. Maybe my theory was correct because it's honestly not that bad. The parking lot looks pretty, pretty normal. When I went over the weekend, it was so bad. It was like the most crowded I've ever seen it. So I'm pretty surprised. Nothing against people that like, I love going to the gym. I'm all for starting the new year with a new fitness program and everything like that. I just get very easily overwhelmed <laughs> and I hate parking more than anything already. So when the parking lot is packed, it gives me like extreme anxiety. But yeah, hello. I hope you all had an amazing New Year's Eve and you're having a good start to the new year. And if not, that's okay. We have a whole year for it to look up. I'm really excited for the new year. I haven't been this excited for a new year in I feel like a really long time, probably since COVID. But today after the gym, I definitely have to go grocery shopping. I have no groceries at home. I feel like I always say that. I feel like I always am out of groceries. <laughs> yeah, I gotta stock up on groceries because one of my New Year's resolutions is to cook more at home. I feel like I cook a decent amount at home, but I also definitely order out way too much. I spend a very 
unnecessary amount of money ordering out it's it's a problem and something that i definitely want to work on this year so i'm definitely going to try to minimize the amount of food delivery that i get um oh also i got some new glasses i went to the optometrist a few days ago i went this past saturday because i haven't gotten my eyes checked in i don't even know how long but going off the momentum of going to the dentist after many years of avoiding it i figured i should also it was also time to get my eyes checked i do have glasses like before i got these glasses i have glasses because i'm nearsighted and i just never wore them because i didn't really like how i looked in them but i got my eyes checked this weekend and i got a new prescription i got a new pair turns out i have astigmatism but i really do like these glasses i think these are really cute the lady was so nice and she helped me find one that fit my face shape really well i will actually start wearing my glasses but yeah i think they're pretty cute but i don't need them when i'm at the gym but i'm gonna go have a good workout if you are someone that's trying to work out more in the new year good luck to you and i really hope that your gym isn't too crowded because i think having gym intimidation and gym anxiety very 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 real and i think when it's like super packed it makes it worse so definitely praying for you if you are someone that's also going to the gym on january 1st i hope you are as lucky as i am <laughs> Okay, so it is 6 p.m. It is so dark outside. I, I did some filming, I did some editing, I cleaned my balcony. Suddenly I, I looked outside and it's pitch, pitch black. I know it's been that way for like a while now, but it still shocks me at how late it looks. And it's only 6 p.m. What the heck? Oh, I feel like my cats are gonna knock. Don't knock, don't knock anything, please. No, no don't do. I'm gonna have a little snack because I'm not super hungry for dinner yet. It feels so late, oh my goodness. These are peanut butter filled pretzels. 
so good. I have to put them in a bowl because if I don't, I will eat like the whole bag in one sitting. If I do that, then I'll probably lose my appetite for dinner and I just went grocery shopping. Yeah, these are addicting. I, mm. My dad and I used to eat these all the time. best part of the night. I got this pajama set from one of my girlfriends. We did a Secret Santa. It was, to my memory, like one of the first Secret Santas I've done, at least in a very, very, very long time. So it was a lot of fun. She also got me this little fan that I use for my skincare now. I use it to dry like my toners, my essences, and anything. I love it. Excuse me, how am I supposed to read?
And that is the end of this video. Thank you for sticking to the end if you did. And also happy new year, happy 2024. Thank you for spending 2023 with me. It was a pretty rough year for me, but you guys are one of the parts that made it worth surviving. So thank you so much. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. Of course you don't have to, but you know, just saying, would love to have you around. And also leave a comment. I love reading and replying to your guys' comments. And yeah, I am very, very excited to spend 2024 with you. And before you go, if you haven't already heard today, you are amazing, you're beautiful, you're wonderful, you are so valid, and I am so, so happy that you are alive. I love you so, so much, and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye!